so what I'm doing in this video, well, honestly what I'm going to say that this is another milestone we hit. Currently I have made 399 videos. Now at the time I'm uploading this is going to be the 400th video I'm making. And this is Untitled 400. Going back to where we left off on the history of this channel, back into the 300th video I made. After making the 300th video for this channel, this was a sign I had to improve the way I make videos. And it was successful, progressing from 2020 to 2021. After the 300th video special, I went back to recording random videos. Where at one point, while playing the streets, I found the VR player having a jolly old time for 1-2 to two minutes. Until he got bored and left. Me and some other people were following and bothering him the entire time. I even tried to make him lose health, when really it didn't happen since VR players cannot lose health. Then I would continue with the Super Mario Bros. 35th anniversary videos where at one point I decided to record myself completing a daily challenge. Then I got bored so I decided to revisit two games, Ultimate Driving and Stop It Slender. In the Ultimate Driving video I literally attempted to drive around the whole map until I got stuck in the mountains. In the Stop It Slender video I was slender and only played one round and got Everyone winning the game about 30 seconds or so before the round automatically ended. I was playing as Slender in the map Charnish. After this I began recording myself doing random emo dances for one minute because I was bored. But before that, I uploaded a video where I was playing Super Mario Bros. 35th Anniversary and losing and getting second place. And then I rage quit afterwards. After finishing with the random dances, I then found out and made a video about the second round of the Common Bot Massacre, which only lasted for a few days involving Little King Ryan and some pornographic pedophile YouTube accounts trying to do kinky acts. While that happened I made a video showing off my achievements to verify I'm not a loser and anyone who calls me a loser is the loser themselves they are calling. After that I announced that the second round of the Common Bot Massacre is over. Then I returned to the normal activity as the next video I made was me getting 3rd place in Super Mario Bros. 35th Anniversary. Then at one point I will make a video showcasing a school project I have made in early 2019 as my final school assignment in the, 29, in the 2018 to 2019 school year. And it was about immigration in the US, the pros and cons. After that I have made a Bloxburg build skipping the 2nd, 3rd and 5th floors only using the basement 1st and 4th floors of the house in Bloxburg. After that I got bored so I finally made a trailer for my channel to introduce myself and this channel for new people. After this I made a tutorial on how I make videos which was also my Halloween special and it's also now as of February 1st is currently outdated. Then I finally introduced my viewers to my dog Nick. Which is not here at this moment. Then I made a few vlogs on renovating my room and how I might do a room tour soon. Then I went to revisit a game called The Plaza 2. Which afterwards I went to do a few videos about it. Like some tours of my deleted builds in that game. And me having a jolly old time with, ga with the game's flaws before May 3rd 2019. When all of it was later patched. Then I made a video about my computer glitching out during online class. So, and here's the thing about it. This only happens when I minimize it and bring it to another monitor screen. And that was during a different computer. Then I made a video about a tropical cycle in my house. And in that case, it was Tropical Storm Edda. Which at the time, it was a Tropical Storm Edda Sapphire Simpson Hurricane wind scale with winds of 65 miles per hour. It was heading north. East or North Northeast or East Northeast, I don't remember the way it was going exactly, but I think it landfall near Tampa. It was raining for a few days, bringing a few inches in my town until it cleared Florida and became extra tropical near the Carolinas. Then I made another Bloxburg build with multiple layers of security and a basement without a ceiling. 
However, a basement without walls or floors is not possible in that game. Then I made random videos about me inspiring others to become rich in Bloxburg. And that was when I first became a millionaire, which at the time I had about $1.4 million. Then YouTube stopped working so I couldn't upload a video. So therefore I made a video about it being broken the entire night. And it was and will be the only video about YouTube itself being broken. Then I explained why I don't roleplay in Roblox anymore. The dumbest people I have encountered to know why I don't roleplay in Roblox anymore. Then I did random Bloxburg skills for one minute until I made a video showcasing myself reaching max level, which was the level 10 in cooking in Bloxburg, respectively. Then I went to show my old documents from 2016 to 2017 from Doc Hub and Microsoft OneNote. Then I made an 18 minute commentary video explaining my best and worst memories in Roblox and my life. Then I started uploading random Switch videos I haven't showed you. And one of these videos was when I uploaded the Prestige Star level in the Super Mario Bros. 35th Anniversary game. In that video I made some theories on why some games skip level 100 and recycle it back to level 1 Prestige. Either because they hate or they are afraid of it. Or it's not, or maybe it's just because it's not enough space. Later I made a video doing a house tour in Minecraft on the Switch. And then finally I made the final video of the Super Mario Bros. 35th Anniversary game. About me reaching first place finally. For the first time ever in that game. And then therefore. I quit and edited the series there. Then I finally went to return to the production of the Splatoon 2 series with its final season. First about the clan party thing in a private battle. Next I made another Bloxburg build with 4 floors. And then the next day I reached 40 subscribers so then I made a video about me playing 2 games where I went insane. The first game I played was Insonal. And the next game, well I don't even remember the game title anymore, not gonna lie. But in the first game I successfully escaped in its second version of the game and was also my first time escaping. In the second game I died due to a quote unquote heart attack in a failed quote unquote experiment. Then after that I finally went to, took a, to take a break from uploading after more than two months of straight and daily entertainment. I took a brief break until I returned with video improvement. Finally. Finally starting you, to be applied using video and audio special effects, finally. Then I showcased a new update from the Switch about accessing Nintendo Switch online directly without using the app or website. Then I uploaded a few and old videos I haven't showed you from my from this computer, like the Pinewood Core Meltdown, the Flores Love game, and the best highlights in the Ultimate Driving Westover Islands game. Then I went to continue production on the final season of Splatoon 2 until I stopped for a while. While I made another Bloxburg build with two floors in the basement. Then I made an announcement about the hacker cartel called Boon Boon, which threatened people on Roblox, when really it was just fake all along. Then I made a video testing slow motion in my phone. Then afterwards I revisited two games, Insurance Fraud Simulator otherwise known as Broken Bones 4, and then the VR Hands game. In the, Broken Four, in the Broken Bones 4 game, there was a toxic baby noob with zero IQ being picky on languages and wants everyone to speak English when really in reality some people can't. He also made homophobic and racist rants. He even tried to dodge in and have backup when his plans fail and he rage quit. The truth is he doesn't know what he doesn't know about the rest of humanity when he is supposed to know, as he tried to act tough when really he wasn't. The username was Captain Grey Seal. If you see him and you speak another language, ignore him and ruin his life. 
Anyways, moving along in Christmas time, I made a special video about Christmas and me about it. Then I showcased only four gifts, which was all I got on camera. Boring, isn't it? Featuring a Samsung watch I use for exercising that I do nowadays when I do not record. Afterwards, I went on to make three Splatoon 2 videos on my computer format. Which recorded, send it to my phone via QR code. Then I upload the three video files into my computer. Then I finished off the series with the Splatoon 2 finale where I showcased all my screenshots in that game. Then I later did the New Year special doing a recap of 2020 and all about it. And also 2020 and me and my channel on it as well, lasting for 11 minutes until the video ended before midnight. And then I made a, tri a tribute video about the death of Adobe Flash. Then I announced that I was going to officially end the series from my phone and switch. So then the next day I did a Bloxburg build with three floors and a basement. Then after this I made a video about some recorded bloopers. After that on January 5th after 30 days of entertainment I took a break for a few days due to schoolwork. Then on January 14th, I returned as I improved video editing with new thumbnails, different dialogue, and different editing techniques. So instead of using the title cards, I decided to start using the generators used in the Kaden Live video editing software. Like the 10 second countdown for, for the old film TVs and a 1 second TV static. I tested them first. And it was successful, so I applied them from them on. And then finally stopped using the occasional intro and outro and copyright until username watermark. Then meanwhile, I made a video about a tour on only a three-story house I did back in August of 2020, which I don't even have anymore. Then I went on to continue with the blank for any duration videos. At that time, I uploaded a video on how to dress up as me in Roblox. As the next day I reviewed random Bloxburg houses, which was so which was so so because I got blocked several times since they considered me a leech and a creep. But it was fine because the next day I went to revisit the game backpacking. After that I started trolling people to pass the time. Then while still playing backpacking I made blank for any duration videos on it as well. Then I made a video about winning an automated backpacking event, which in that case was the medium hang gliding event, winning first place. And now I'm here talking to you about the third part of the documentary of the history of this channel. It took until March 20, 2020 to reach 100 videos. It took until July 2nd, 2020 to reach 200 videos. It took until October 17th to reach 300 videos. And now it finally took until February 1st to reach 400 videos. Alright, so this is all I'm going to say here in the special production. So since that is the case, therefore, goodbye for now.